So here's Yoshi in his uh, bike biking harness here. It's just a basic harness. Come here. And it has a uh, it's basically a rope with an overhand knot and a simple clip. And on the other end, I also have a clip and and tied to me. And what this is, this is a rope climbing harness that I've tied a knot in so I can harness this around me. Um, the bike is a uh, it's a Citizen Tokyo. And there, it's a folding bike. I didn't necessarily need a folding bike, though it's remarkably convenient. But the important part about it is is this part. It's being able to get on and off of it in a hurry. And also the seat goes up and down a lot. Um, another reason I chose it over, say, a BMX bike is that it has very good brakes. Um, it's already come tuned. These are 16 inch wheels. These are not, uh, the usual is about 20 inch. Uh, the main thing is I want to be able to get on and off of it in a hurry. Um, and because it's, the point of this is to exercise my dog, unlike a BMX bike, it has multiple gears. So even though it's only five gears, it can go fast enough for a, a little corgi. Um, and the other nice thing is that these, these pedals actually fold. I don't know if I can do this one-handed, but you press this in and then it will fold. I can't do it right now. Can I do it? Yes, it will. So yeah, you press it in and it will fold and it fits in the car very nicely this way. And the other thing is that you can lower, first of all, I would change the seat. It's not very comfortable. But the other thing is that I can lower this to be so low I can get my feet on the ground and use it just like a scooter. So this particular one is the Citizen and the model name is the Tokyo. And it's under $200. It's a surprisingly affordable little bike. And it comes pre-tuned. Unlike, say, the, the Schwinn version, which is kind of iffy from what the reviews indicate. And I think Yoshi approves, don't you, dude? Yes, he does. Yes, he does. Uh -huh. Good boy. Good boy.